The Yellowstone supervolcano is a humbling reminder of the endless power of nature. It is a massive force that will devastate much of North America when it will erupt. But when exactly will that happen? How catastrophic will the consequences be for America and the world? Watch this video to the end and you will find out the answers to these most important questions of mankind. So let's get started. We'll be broken up in the open field. Yellowstone's famous caldera can lay claim as North America's most well-known supervolcano. But it isn't the continent's largest. A more ancient one, found near the small southwestern Utah town of Enterprise, was about 30 times bigger. So, let's go over some facts you probably didn't know. Fact number one, not imminent eruption. Despite sensationalized reports, researchers are not sure that the Yellowstone supervolcano will erupt anytime soon. Unfortunately, however, the historically recorded cyclical nature of eruptions leaves little choice as to whether there will be an eruption earlier or later. Yellowstone's history suggests that it is inevitable. Fact number two, caldera size. Until recently, it was believed that the Yellowstone caldera, or supervolcano, spans approximately 45 by 30 miles, making it roughly the size of Rhode Island. However, recent research has shown that the caldera is actually much larger, and it may be as large as 50 miles by 80 miles. It is nine miles deep, fueling the active geysers and hot springs. This gigantic heat reservoir maintains temperatures of 800 to 1,700 degrees Fahrenheit. Fact number three, geological fieldwork. The Yellowstone caldera was discovered through geological fieldwork in the 1960s and 1970s by Bob Christensen from the US Geological Survey. A tremendous magma chamber with molten rock remains active beneath Yellowstone's surface, fueling the geysers, bubbling mud puddles and hot springs in the area. Fact number four, supervolcano eruptions. Over the past 2.1 million years, the Greater Yellowstone region has experienced three super eruptions, with the most recent one occurring 640,000 years ago. These eruptions were massive, and they each spewed out enough ash and rock to cover much of North America. Yellowstone's megavolcano erupts catastrophically every 600,000 to 900,000 years on average. This places us statistically overdue for the next eruption. Fact number five, global impact. If a supervolcano erupts, it can release gases, debris, and magma high into the air, significantly altering Earth's atmosphere. It is believed that the eruption will cause significant climate change on the planet for at least a few years, referred to as a nuclear winter or a volcanic winter. Many, if not all, species of vegetation and animal life could disappear due to the cold, lack of sun, and food. It is estimated that an eruption of the Yellowstone supervolcano could kill billions of people. Dr. Robert B. Smith, a volcanologist with the United States Geological Survey, wrote, The potential consequences of a Yellowstone supereruption are enormous. The eruption would likely cause widespread death and destruction and could potentially have a global impact. The ash from the eruption would darken the skies, block out sunlight, and cause temperatures to plummet. This would disrupt agriculture and food production and could lead to widespread famine. The eruption would also release massive amounts of greenhouse gases, which could contribute to climate change. In short, a Yellowstone super eruption would be a major catastrophe. Fact number six. A full-scale Yellowstone eruption could spew ash across landscapes up to thousands of miles away with even coastal cities like Los Angeles facing ash accumulation. Air travel across North America might be disrupted for a long time by ash hazards to aircraft. For example, the Lava Creek eruption of the Yellowstone caldera, which occurred 640,000 years ago, ejected approximately 1,000 cubic kilometers, 240 cubic miles, of rock, dust, and volcanic ash into the atmosphere. Fact number seven. 
Scientists detect between 1,000 to 3,000 mini earthquakes rumbling below Yellowstone each year as magma moves and churns underground. Though most go unfelt by humans above ground, but inevitably brings us closer to a fatal denouement. Fact number eight, predicting eruptions. Despite the best efforts of scientists, there is no way to predict exactly when the Yellowstone supervolcano will erupt. However, they can monitor the volcano for signs of activity and give warnings if they believe that an eruption is imminent. Researchers believe that there would be warning signs before a supervolcano eruption, such as significant ground swelling due to increasing pressure from underneath. Recent seismic activity at Yellowstone does not confirm an imminent eruption. Although, to tell the truth, in recent years, some increase in the soil level in the crater of the supervolcano has been recorded. So, for example, in 2013, the floor of the Yellowstone caldera mysteriously rose rapidly over several months, gaining unprecedented elevation, accumulating to over 10 inches total of newly uplifted land. Fact number nine, scientific monitoring. The Yellowstone Volcano Observatory, established in 2001, uses advanced tools and techniques to monitor volcanic activity in the Yellowstone region, assess potential hazards, and provide timely warnings. At the same time, the meaning of such a warning and possible actions of the authorities and the population are unclear, given the global catastrophic nature of the consequences of the eruption. Fact number 10, researchers drilling directly into Yellowstone's magma chamber have extracted superheated near-molten rock that is chemically and isotopically evidence the magma chamber may still be partially molten and active, contrary to prior assumptions. Despite the potential danger, the Yellowstone supervolcano is also a symbol of hope. It is a reminder that our planet is a dynamic place that is constantly changing. It is also a reminder that we are all connected to each other and that we must work together to protect our planet for future generations. That's all the facts for today. We'll get back to you in a couple days with a new dizzying investigation. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to always be aware of the most mysterious and amazing events of civilization.